Hey friends, this is Travis, your Manufactured Home Nerd. I am excited to show you this house today. This is The Saint by Champion of Leesville, Champion Skyline of Leesville. Uh, the reason I'm super excited is I've had walked a lot of floor plans very similar to it, and they build these homes right 40 miles away from us, but I have yet to have a customer order it, and so I'm glad to be able to show my customers what this house looks like, let them get an idea of it, and see just how it feels. As you see here on the outside, they have two accent, they have an accent vinyl set in the dormer to give you a nice little contrast, shutters on the either side of the windows, and you have that little uh, tin shed over the windows there as well. And give you a nice little feature so we're gonna step on inside and see what this house looks like now we are in River Lake homes in Winsboro so you'll get a good idea of their homes and how they set them up but also you know that we carry these same product down at Bolton homes I'd be glad to answer any questions you might have now coming in it's a very open floor plan a lot of great features in here before we get to the kitchen let's take a look at that living room you have an optional entertainment center. It does come in standard, but it doesn't come in with the electric fireplace. And they have chosen to do that. Here, you have the shiplap accent around it, but you also can do a ceramic tile around your electric fireplace as well, and a place for your TV. And that would fit a big TV. One of the features that many of the Champion homes have is this vaulted ceiling in the living dining room kitchen area and so you can see here you got a lot of space in your living room but that vaulted ceiling just makes it feel much bigger and it's got that beam mdf beam running the whole length of it now coming into this kitchen this floor plan well the wind said the door needed a slam i did, guess i didn't close it all the way you have the optional large island in here i don't know if y'all can see that feature color there but it looks great it's almost like a copper but it's also a little red and you got it on the hood as well and those are, of course optional hoods cabinet stacks for pantry storage smooth top stove I get a little better view of this hood the little screws with like the rivet look and then the floating shelves all just a nice little feature now this house is available as 90% painted sheetrock. And what that means is that your utility and bathrooms would not be painted sheetrock. But you can see here, they got the painted sheetrock through most of the house. It does come standard in the living room, kitchen and dining room, and optional in the master bath and most of the time in most of their homes. Large stainless steel farm sink, no divider or dishwasher there. They do stainless appliances standard and so you, but you, the side-by-side -side is an upgrade, and so is the smooth top stove. And coming in off this room here is your utility room. Let me throw the light on there. You got washer dryer space with shelving above. There's your exit door. And then there is a little locker space with cubbies at the bottom, cubbies at the top, and a place to hang coats or backpacks. And you can easily add a freezer plug here next to the breaker box if you wanted to have an upright or a deep freeze. I actually am really thankful I got to look at this. It's a ton of light windows in here. A ton of windows, thermopane windows help with the light bill. Of course, when we order this home, we always do the upgrade insulation, so that helps with the light bill as well. But this one is just great looking house. And I love these light fixtures here too, the little air bubbles in the glass. I'm sure that looks great when you have the electricity onto the house. And then y'all know that Champion does the vents in the ceiling standard, does a metal roof standard. And they had that cordless ceiling fan there as an option as well. You get the white crown molding, but they cased out the living room here with the brown molding. You could probably do the white molding as well or sheetrock it in if you like. More storage here at the end of the hallway. Nice little cabinet stack there. Let's we'll see how deep it is. And it is fairly deep, so you could easily fit towels and blankets and pillows in there. Or board games. Now, these bedrooms are pretty big. This house has a lot of space for a house that's only a 52-foot box. But you see that you could easily fit a large bed in here. 
It's got a good walk-in closet here. Not the biggest, not the smallest, but you do have a lot of rack footage in there. Bedroom three, I'm sure is very, very similar. Let's get a look at that. Yeah, it is still a good size. Easily fit your queen size bed and a dresser and have an actual walk-in closet for here where it is a lot of space. So let me, there you go. Now y'all can see a little better. And y'all see in the closet, they have the, they don't have painted sheetrock. They have the wallboard. Same should be in the, no, it looks like we got painted sheetrock in the bathroom too. So utility and closets. And then you got the ceramic sink. Now they come with a matte black metal faucet. And of course they do shut off valves at all your sinks as well as your toilets. This is the large fiberglass tub shower combo and my favorite transom windows. Y'all know I love to read with the natural lighting, so that's always nice. Let's see if I can get this light to come off. Doesn't quite want to do it, so let's go on in here, check out the master bedroom. Fortunately, we don't have a bed in here, but a king-size bed, California king would fit in here very well. They got the ceiling fan in here as well. <coughs> Pardon me. A large walk-in closet. No carpet in the home standard. And then let's go check out this master bathroom. Huge vanity, more cabinets for more storage, two sinks, large drawer stack, elongated toilet, and your deck tub with frosted safety glass, and it opens, so that's always nice as well. And then they have the standard fiberglass shower in here. This is a 60 inch, but you do have the option to do an aluminum shower that appears to be like tile. So if you guys have questions about this home or any of the homes you see on this YouTube page, make sure to hit a comment. Let me know what you're wanting to know or are thinking or, or what your thoughts are on the color schemes of the houses. Love to hear from you. Always love feedback. And of course, don't forget to like and subscribe. We got two houses that come out every week, Sundays and Wednesdays. And the only way to get notified is if you hit that little bell after you subscribe. So thanks for watching. I hope you enjoyed the video. If you have questions, don't hesitate to reach out. Thanks for watching. Have a great day. Happy house hunting.